Yo, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another one of my cube world tutorials. So I figured I would put together a really quick tutorial on bombs right now. Um, kind of where to use them and why they're useful. So let's jump straight to it. Okay, so there is another item that you can get throughout the game, um, besides your weapons, and that is bombs. Now these can obviously inflict damage to enemies, but they also do have a couple of other uses. Um, you can get varying strength bombs, just like with armor and weapons, depending on the power you have, you can use different ones. So if you look, for example, on my one, I've got bomb plus 29, but I've also got a bomb plus 10. Um, and then obviously, you know, the stronger you are, the stronger the bomb is. Now, as I said, you can just use them to, you know, inflict damage on enemies, and for example, the first time I found some bombs, I actually found them lying around in a dungeon. I was walking around a castle, and then I did go through to fight a boss. So then, because the bosses don't necessarily always move around quite as much, and because they are quite big, you can drop some bombs and, you know, inflict a bit of damage. Um, but you can also buy these from the standard item shop, the one that's got the icon of the potion. Um, so yeah, besides damage, the other thing you want to use them for is actually kind of like destroying rocks. There are certain rocks you can destroy. You can't just destroy anything, so you, you know, you can't necessarily walk up to kind of a nice green hill like this and just start blowing holes in it but um, typically things that are actually rock then you can you know destroy them so if you look over here for example um, I'm paying close attention to the fact that there's a bat down there um, but I can't you know I can't actually get down there but typically bats tend to you know indicate that there's a cave down there so with that in mind I'm gonna go and select my bomb which I have already here and then I'm gonna drop it with Q um, no please go away Sorry, let me just kill this guy. There we go. And as you can see, the bomb blew away a bit of the wall, and I can now get into this area. Um, but let me just do that again, just so you can see. Let me just dispatch this back, because there we go. Right, sorry. Um, so yeah, when you place down a bomb, you press Q, and then you look at it, you can see there's got a little fuse that goes down, so let's run away from it, because I don't want to get hurt. Um, and then... Blows up again, and... Okay, that one wasn't very exciting. Um, let's go further into here, and try again. There we go, that's better. Um, but yeah, you know, it's clear for you to see that you cannot blow up everything, but there are certain rocks that you can. So there are, there will, you know, most typically um, there'll be times when, for example, if you're walking through a cave, you will find an area that it looks like you can go there, but it has clearly been blocked off. So those are the times that you want to use bombs. So make sure you always carry them with you because they can, they can be quite useful. You know, especially if you're adventuring through a cave and you find that you've got a lot of ore as you go along, and typically if something's blocked off, you know, normally there's something cool behind it. So if you've got a bomb, then you can make sure you can get to it. So that is pretty much it, you know, it was only a really, really quick one, um, but I figured it was worth kind of just highlighting that bombs are really useful and they are something that you should carry with you at all times. So, as always, don't forget to drop a comment down below if you have another question, and I will do my best to answer it. But otherwise, thanks for watching, don't forget to like and share this video, it does really help me out, and obviously don't forget to subscribe. Also, don't forget to check out the Facebook page, the Twitter page, and the Arrows Gaming website for all your news throughout the week. Otherwise, take it easy, catch you next time, peace out.